Well, good morning, guys. Welcome to another vlog. Um, today I am actually in Paris. Um, if you've been following my channel, you would have seen that I've been in Disneyland for the last three days. Um, we left there last night and came to a hotel in Paris, which is the Hotel Paris Louis, Louis Blanc. And it's near the Garden Nord, because that's where we're getting our train home later. But we're not getting the train until like 7 o'clock tonight. So we have a full day in Paris. We're going to go and do some sightseeing. I'm obviously going to vlog it and take you guys along. Um, if you're interested, yeah, we're staying in the Louis Blanc and I'll give you a quick room tour. We stayed there last night. So obviously this is the window um, and it just li literally looks down onto the street. There's quite a busy area, there's lots of cars and stuff. But yeah, we're on the fourth floor. That's the view. And then we've just got a bed, which me and I had to share, which is funny. <laughs> And we've got a map there because just working out where we want to go today. Uh, obviously there's a TV on the wall. My King Louis from Disneyland. There's mama, her mum over there sitting by the desk. <laughs> and then we have the mirror. And then just a the standard bathroom, a toilet, a sink, a little shower. And then literally that's the door there where you come in. It's not the best room I've got to say. <laughs> We didn't we really come in and was like, oh, it's not the best. But, you know, it did the job with just here for one night. And after this, we are going into Paris. So, yes, I'm going to take you along. I think we're going to try and do Arc de Triomphe from the area, maybe Place de, Place de Bastille. I am really bad at French pronunciation, so I do apologise. Um, maybe go and look at the Eiffel Tower, because we've been up it before, but we haven't got like, a lot of photos. So we're going to do some photos there in the Champs-Élysées. That's kind of the rough plan, but I'm just sort of getting the map out now, working out where to go. And obviously I'll take you with me and uh, let's see <coughs> what adventures we can get up to in Paris. So guys, we just got off the train at City. We've got the Metro, obviously I didn't film that because it's weird getting my camera out, but look at these beautiful buildings along here. Just walking past the river, we're heading over to the Notre Dame to go and have a look at that, but uh, it's a lovely day as well. Beautiful blue skies, an amazing looking building over there. I'm just going to have a little explore and have a look, but I think we're going to go find the Notre Dame first, see if we can find the Hunchback. What do you think so far? It's a pretty day, isn't it? It's a lovely day. A bit hectic getting here though. Yeah, it's very hectic. Obviously it's a city, so... Yes, we're going to go find the Notre Dame. It should be up here and to the right. So we're going to go have a look and I'll obviously get some footage for you when I get there. So we've made it to the Notre Dame. And there it is. It is a little hodge building. Very grand. We just had a little walk down there, looked in a few of the tourist tat shops. But yeah, look at that, that's beautiful. Very busy around here, you've got kind of like a park area around. Yeah, that big statue there. Lots of people taking photos. Yeah, it's beautiful. I just want to ask, like, where is the hunchback? <laughs> what do you think, Mum? Absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, massive. It is massive. Right, I'm going to take some photos. <laughs> so just here, sort of little shadow. It's ringing. Bells. The bells are ringing. And we've got this big, massive statue here. Look at the size of the bomb on that horse. Yeah, it looks really cool. I can bring you round, actually. Let's see if you can see it. Which is just outside the Notre Dame. And the guy's faces are really scary. I don't know if you can see that, especially the guy on the horse. But yeah. Such a nice day. As it's such a nice day, I think we're gonna like walk along the river and head towards the Eiffel Tower to get some photos. There's a mum over there holding my bag. And yes, I still have my princess bag even though I'm not Disney anymore. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> but yeah, I think we're gonna go for a walk down the river. I'll try and get some footage because it's so so beautiful today. We might go and find the um, bridge that has all the locks on it as well because that's kind of on route. So yes, let's have a look. We're walking towards the Eiffel Tower and we're just at the stem. If we just look down there, I just love this. There's this little guy and he's um, painting. I mean, that to me is so French, so Parisian. He's just painting the river. And look how beautiful this painting is as well. You can see. Yeah, he's doing like the scene. So he's there and he's basically doing that over there. If you look at the picture, he's done amazing. Like, it's beautiful. I just had to show you that, guys, because of, you know, I just think that's amazing. Very French. Yep. 
So we're going to keep walking, we're just going to head that way, just walk along the river and see where we come to. We've got lots of buses. So we've come to the Point de Arts Bridge. This is where they normally have all the locks, but obviously they've taken them off recently because I suppose it was weighing the bridge down. <laughs> and they didn't want the bridge to collapse, but look how beautiful the Seine is looking today. All the boats along there. Absolutely beautiful. There is some locks over on the um, lamp posts. I'll show you actually. Beautiful walk over there. I can show you. In the meantime, you can have a beautiful view of the river. But yeah, people are putting a few on here now. I think this is all they're allowed to do, but all the little love locks, John and Renee. I need that one. How cute is this though? I see there's like loads on that one over there. Like loads. But yeah. How romantic. This one has even more locks in it. Look how many locks are on this one. So many. <clears throat> I like that one. It's a big one. Buy them actually. Yeah, they're actually like Paris Lava locks. The little stalls down, like along here, you can actually buy them. Oh, that one's nice. Look at that. So pretty. Beautiful. You can actually see the Eiffel Tower there. Can you see where my finger is? It's just above there. That is the Eiffel Tower. That is where we're heading. <laughs> still walking down. Still walking down the river and uh, there's lots of boats. If you can see over there, there's also the, I'm going to say the Paris Eye. It's like the London Eye, but like the Paris version of. <clears throat> oh, such a beautiful day. It's a really nice walk. Behind we've got the new Musée de Orsay. All these amazing architectural building and there we have the boats you've got to see the boat after though the, the, the amount of people <coughs> excuse me on this boat is crazy <laughs> look at it there's so many let me try and zoom in a little bit for you you can see the eye in the background there oh, the Paris big wheel and then yeah the amount of people on this boat is uh, crazy Must be all tourists, must be like a tourist boat or something. So we've all got cameras out and the phones. Oh, there's another boat coming this way. A big flat one, that's an odd looking boat. It's like a ghost ship. <laughs> it's crazy how busy this river is though, like, it is crazy. It's always boats, so I thought I'd have to get in the camera and show you a bit of the uh, boat footage. Yeah, that, that, that's weird. Look how many people on that boat. That's crazy. We're gonna keep walking. This direction. Mm. Hi guys, now where you can see me because the sun is so bright. Is that better? I can't see, but I'm not sure. Anyway, we have found the Eiffel Tower. And there she is. Looking beautiful. There's a bit of a fence here. We are going to try and get some photos in a bit, but we thought we'd come and have a little picnic, so we've got some rolls. This one's chicken and egg, I think. We've got healthy strawberries, which look amazing. We've got some juice, which is <coughs> the green mild kiwi lime and pear. We can have this, sit by the tower, have a little bit of a chill, because we've walked for miles, rest the little feet. Yeah, and then we're going to take some photos by the Eiffel Tower. I think we're going to head to the Champs Elysees and walk up there and look at the shops. Maybe find a Disney store for you Disney fans. And um, yeah, it's been a nice day so far. What do you think? Lovely. <laughs> Lovely. I'm eating. I'm sorry, <laughs> Mum's eating. Yeah, it's been nice. It's nice to get there. It's taken us a long time to walk it, but it's just been nice. I'm just taking it kind of a chill. So, yes, yeah, so I'm going to eat my lunch, have a little picnic here, and um, I'll speak to you in a little bit, guys. So, hey guys, look where I am. By the Eiffel Tower. It's so, I actually can't see you. I hope I'm filming and I'm in focus and I'm on the screen because <laughs> the sun's right in my face. But yeah, look how beautiful. Well, there's a lot of fences and stuff around at the moment, all along here, all around the bottom. I don't know if I like doing things to it, like 
refurb, I don't know, but uh, yeah, it's crazy. At the Eiffel Tower. Beautiful day in Paris, the picnic was lovely. Enjoy the picnic? Lovely, we had strawberries. Yeah, it's good, so we're just gonna go for another walk now and then um, head to Champs Elysees when we find the Disney store. Yeah, we're gonna go for another walk down by the river and just take it slow. It's been a nice day so far, but I'm definitely excited to get a lakey. Lakey? Lakey legs! <laughs> There's so much walking in the last few days, but yes. And um, I'll catch up with you in a little bit. We're just heading towards uh, Champs Elysees. We want to go to uh, the Disney store. We found Valentino. We've got Prada over there, Giorgio, Mai. I just feel like, whoa, this is places that I would never be able to shop at because. Go. Way too expensive. But yes, we're heading down this way. There's Valentino there. Here's me. Hi. Oh, I feel like I'm a sweaty mess. It's so warm today. Mum's actually got a bit of sunburn on her neck from where we've been walking so much. It's mental. So, yes, let's, let's try and find this Disney store. It'll be really cool to see the Paris one because, you know, why not? There's a Disney store. We, we should find it, definitely. Don't you reckon? Yeah, it'd be different things, wouldn't it? Yes, we're going to have a look at Guys, we found the Disney store. Shops of these, I might have been in there. And bought, we well, had to get the bag because it says Paris, Disney store Paris. There might be a little something in there, but uh, I'll probably add it to my Disneyland haul. But yes, it's so warm today. How hot? <laughs> so warm. We're going to carry walking down there so we can find Arc de Triomphe before heading back towards the hotel, I think. But yes, I'm very pleased that I found the Disney store. And we found the Arc de Triomphe. There we go, it's been a long walk down the Champs Elysees, but there it is. It's the craziest roundabout in Paris, like all cars that's going around, but uh, it's so busy. But there you go, we found it. It's actually bigger than what I thought it was going to be. Do you reckon it's bigger? <laughs> it's like people on the top. Yeah, there's actually people on the top there, so they must have like, I pay a fee to get up there. And, Actually. I wonder if you can see that like a tower behind me, what's it? Yeah, I am. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm like a sweaty mess right now. I can't even speak to the point. This is so nice. I'm hot, I'm sweaty, I've worn out, we've walked how many kilometres did I say? It must be about 12, 12 or 13 kilometres today. Go us, so <laughs> I'm knackered. We're literally just gonna, um, I'll just show you what I actually bought in the shop. Look how much apple juice I've got here. I'm so thirsty, <laughs> I just need fluids and sugar. So I'm gonna sit and enjoy that, I'm gonna have a shower, we're gonna pack up and we're gonna head to the train station. So I know it's a short and sweet visit to uh, Paris, but I hope you enjoyed what I showed you and what we got up to. I tried to get some footage of like, you know, those kind of landmarks and stuff that we saw today. I did get a bit of sunburn as well on my arm, which is not so good. <laughs> it was that hot, I've got a bit of sunburn. I didn't bring sun cream, I didn't expect it to be like this, but um, yeah, so um, I'm gonna vlog off basically. It's what I'm trying to say, unsuccessfully. Um, anyway, if you liked this video, then please give it a big thumbs up for me. Leave any comments below, etc., etc., and subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll be back with some more travel vlogs very soon. So watch your space. I hope you're all well. And until then, I will speak. Well, I can't speak. <laughs> I will speak to you later. See you soon, guys. Bye.